Welcome to our first activity. Here's the breaking news. Yes, when Zinhua 15, a heavy load cargo carrier selling from the East China Sea, unloads at Bijanjam port this Rone, it will do more than just set down the sites for gigantic cranes. All also put India on the map for the world's biggest container ships. Located near the southernmost tip of the country, the Business Transshipment Container Port, the first of its kind in India that will be inaugurated on October 15, will allow India to grab a bigger slice of the international maritime trade currently dominated by China. It will also bluster its aspirations to be an alternative manufacturing hub by reducing logistics cost for cargo coming to and from the country. The new terminal will be another feather in the cap of Gautam Adani's conglomerate which faced a scathing short seller attack in January alleging corporate manifestance charges the Adani group has denied. With the domains that already spans ports, mines, airports and power utilities, Businessism will further cement the billionaire status as India's infrastructure king. The proximity to the international shipping routes that accounts for 30% of global cargo traffic and the natural channel that goes up to 24 meters below the sea makes businessism an ideal hub for some of the world's biggest ships to call in. Until now, the biggest container ships have been skipping India because its harbors were not deep enough to handle such vessels and docking at neighboring ports such as Colombo, Dubai and Singapore. Transshipments refers to transferring cargo from an original ship to another bigger mother ship at a port on the way to the cargo's final destination. The much awaited deep sea port along Kerala's scenic coastline has been developed by Adani Ports and Special Economic Zone Limited in collaboration with the local state government. Adani Ports, India's largest private sector port operator with 30% market share, is also developing Israel's Haifa port and plans to build a hub in Vietnam as part of its expanding global footprint. Bandazi Post TV.